remember the video, the short video that I did about uh, engine noise, which I'm going to play right now. <laughs> As you can see, everything is completely apart. Um, I'm sorry, I won't, I won't do a video about how to replace the head, the cylinder head, yet, because I have a little bit of time. But I will have other videos. Um, it will be the main bearing and the road bearing replacements that you already saw previously. And in the future, it will be the pistons and the cylinder lining replacements which is what I'm gonna do right now. So, uh, what was the problem with the engine making that noise? Um, after going through whole the engine, and that was the main reason why I couldn't do a video, because I was researching what was the problem with this truck. I mean, making sure what is the cause of that noise, because it was like a going away and coming back, something like that. So, um, after research, all over the head there was nothing wrong all over the head so i got it uh, i needed to go under the head so the head is completely removed i have it right here um as you can see everything looks all right there is you don't uh, see any problems with the head everything looks on position not no broken uh cylinder valves not uh pieces of metal destroying something everything looks on position but uh, you need to take a closer look of, of everything so before taking everything apart I start researching piston by piston and I noticed this as you can see this piston has the cylinder ball mark signs over here as you can see they're clearly visible there is the other one right there and there is the other one right here this one is not noticeable because this one has the gap for the J-brake. This is where the J-brake uh, opens and that's why the J-brake works. Otherwise the piston will get completely destroyed. And uh, looking at the other pistons, you can see, you don't see those marks completely. There is no marks, see? Only these ones, you can see the, it's clearly visible, as you can see. So, my assumption of the problem was that the uh, piston pin was broken, which is right. So the piston pin on this engine is broken. This one over here, especially number two, uh, is the one that is broken. I want to show you how the noise is coming when they, I rotate the engine. See, I'm going to rotate the engine right now and you're going to hear the noise coming from the piston. Here. You hear it, right? That's the noise that is coming from the piston. That's the reason why this that engine was uh, this engine was making that clicking noise, like a coin noise. So that's what you have to do to research what's going on with an engine. Um, I did spend a lot of time trying to figure out what was the problem uh, because it's easy just to replace parts, but knowing what's the cause of the problem that's the hard part because you got it pay little more attention to figure out what's the cause of the engine failure. In this case, I already know, then the cylinder number two has to be replaced. But um, because I have the whole engine completely apart, I'm going to be replacing the whole uh, six cylinders and the head. So it will be a complete engine overhaul, what I wanna do. So uh, as I said before, I'm sorry, I'm going to, I won't do I haven't done an uh, engine a cylinder uh, replacement yet, but uh, little by little I'm trying to make every every video together to make a uh, overhaul playlist on my on my channel, so you can see how to uh, do an engine on the D15 engine if you wanna do it or you just wanna know how someone does it. 
so uh, well I will do a different video how to replace the pistons and the cylinder liners just stay tuned on my channel to see that video coming soon so if you have any questions about this video you can use the comment section below uh, for um, any uh, answer, uh, uh, question that you have about this video or anything then you want to add recommendations and stuff like that then you wish to just add to my videos um, if uh, you want to send some support to my channel you can check the video description below for details how to send support to my channel so i can continue making helpful videos for everybody then wants to learn or wants to see how to do something so like share subscribe and thank you for watching